Hey guys, it's your girl Miss Pink. How are you? Uh, I'm totally having like a bad lock day today. <laughs> I had to throw on my headband and I've got my glasses on today because it's just it's an off day. I'm off today, so no makeup, no contacts, no nothing. But as you can see, I'm stained here because I um went and it's crazy because you can actually see the glare from my mirror and my glasses which is so weird and then I have a terrible glare from the light above me whatever so we're gonna try our best to get that together so um I just came back home about 10 minutes ago from a little haul I uh, decided to go for a walk and I stopped at my local CVS and um Actually, the day before that, I went um, on Jamaica app to pick up some things. I had to pick up some, some hair stuff for my girlfriend. Um, she loves Miss Jessie's, and we get Miss Jessie's on Jamaica app. So um, we had to pick up some wrapper recovery for her. Uh, so I picked up a few things. So I guess I'll go to the Jamaica Avenue stuff first, and then I'll go to the CBS stuff. <sighs> so um, I really wanted to try to get into the uh, pink lips that everybody seems to be rocking lately and of course obviously because pink is my favorite color I wanted to try to see if I could um, find a couple of things that would complement my skin tone I'm well wow I haven't used Mac in about 12 years um, but I'm an NW45 and um, I don't and I'm a golden deep in bare minerals so okay um i needed a concealer i wanted a concealer that was a little darker than my skin tone so that i could um use it to contour my cheek area especially right in here because i have a very chiseled face you know but i like to really give face so um i stopped at one of my beauty supplies of course it's like one on every block, maybe two on every block on Jamaica Avenue, and I picked up the uh, Ruby Kisses 3D Face Creator. Can you see that? Um, it's actually pretty good. The hardest part is actually getting it open. I have to find something sharp to pry it open with. And there are our two colors. Of course, we've got the dark side and we've got the light side. So um, I'll be using the darker brown for my um, contouring. And uh, I didn't want to get like a like a black brown because I didn't want to look like um, a gazelle. There's nothing worse than gazelle face. Not cute, you know. Where you you look like you. In an episode of The Lion King, not cute, not cute at all. I'm so trying to block out this glare. It's terrible. So anyway, um, I got this, and actually I love it. The colors work really well on my skin tone. Um, and I use the lighter side, obviously, to hide blemishes, etc., etc., on my face. Um, it's actually pretty good. And uh, how much did I pay for it? You're supposed to be prepared for these things, girl. Luckily, I keep my receipts. And I got this at, ah, at yes, at Boss Beauty Supply. And I paid $4.99. $4.99 for the duo. And it comes with uh, six grams. Six grams, 0.21 ounces of um, product pretty good oh wow um, can we talk about how loud my TV is right now sorry I was watching uh, set it off <laughs> I was watching set it off as one of my favorite movies of course um, let's see now let's continue oh, that was the Ruby Kisses so what else did I get from Jamaica app oh I got some NYX I got some NYX products because I love NYX products. And like I said, I'm really on this this pink kick. And actually what I really wanted, what I was looking for, was the uh, NYX Mega Shine in Dolly Pink. I really was looking for that, but okay. 
There's a really great store that I get certain things from. It's called Rocks. I usually talk about it a lot on my blog, um, pinkbeauty78.blogspot.com. I talk about it so much on my blog because I get a lot of good deals there. Um, I get my e.l.f. stuff three for $12 all the time over there. Um, and they do have a NYX section, but they charge ridiculous prices because like I can go to rocks and I'll see that they charge eleven dollars for the round lipsticks and for the mega shines but I'll go to a beauty supply and they charge five dollars or four dollars for it so it's like why mark it up an extra seven dollars extra eight dollars for your pocket like that's stupid and then they want to know why they have a full NYX um, display because no one's gonna pay eleven dollars for a tube of lipstick no way. Not a tube of NYX lipstick. Not happening. So I went to my beauty supply that I know I can get my NYX stuff for cheap. But unfortunately, they don't carry the Mega Shines. So I settled for the uh, Soft Matte Lip Cream in Addis Ababa. Everybody always mispronounces this. Addis Ababa is <laughs> a place in Africa, actually. Um, Rastafarians refer to it as um, one of their Meccas. You know, Addis Ababa. So, um, yeah, so I got it. Now, here's my thing. As you can see, I have pigmented lips. Um, they are dark on the bottom, and then I just have, like, a little bit of pink in the middle. It's, I get it from my mom. Love you, mom. Now, I had purchased a, a matte soft lip cream before, and I believe it was, I don't know, it was in some nude color, and I absolutely hated it. It made my lips look like I was, you know, just embalmed and ready to be buried. But I figured, you know, the Dolly pink, you know, or the Addis Ababa, you know, nice hot pinkish kind of color would be okay. Um, it's okay. It smells nice. Um, it goes on okay. I don't know what it is about, about this matte color stuff that I just don't, I don't know what it is. It, it, it works well for me. Um. It just doesn't go on smooth it ends up sinking into the little cracks because you know I have very full lips so I have a lot of wrinkling you know in and through my lips and then what happens is when I apply my lipstick you know, and I make the lipstick face <laughs> the color ends up getting caught in between the pigment and the non pigmented parts so it like it looks weird but what I ended up actually doing was I purchased the uh, NYX sheer gloss and um, I think this was like a dollar ninety nine dollar ninety nine at the, the beauty supply I believe and this one is in um, 04 caramel so I love the little applicator very very cute so I bought this and it's a squeeze so you just squeeze the product up and so I bought that also hoping that maybe that would give it a little shine and um, it did actually this is let's see if make sure I can get this correct here okay this bottom one is the um, sheer gloss in uh, caramel and the top here is the soft matte lip cream in Addis Ababa so the two of them together this light is so terrible whatever anyway I don't know if you guys can see it in this light but oh there we go yeah that's the sheer gloss and that's the uh, soft matte lip cream now the two of them together was really great and then I put a clear gloss layer on top as well and that actually made everything come together I don't know why it just doesn't I can only it seems like if I you know I hate hearing this from women of color all the time especially women who have pigmented lips I can't wear reds I can't wear pinks so I'm trying to see what it is that gels and what works well with me I can go like nude 
and I can go dark like I can do browns I can do you know the the really dark violet purples and those look great but then as soon as I start moving towards the pink it's like the glosses are the only things that seem to work well with me I don't know so anyway moving on um that was my Jamaica Avenue stop and then um, I came back into my own neighborhood in, in, uh, in, in St. Albans and walked over to my CVS. And of course, lo and behold, ah, all those little yellow tags staring at me, waving at me. <laughs> Buy one, get one 50% off, blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. So, um, but of course, you know, they didn't have any of the colors that I wanted. I have so much nude colors. I don't want nudes. I'm trying to break out of the nudes and go into the colors. So um, they did have the uh, Revlon Just Bitten Kissable um, Balm Stains. And that's why, of course, my lips have this pretty pink stain on them from wiping this balm off. And that's what I'm left with. This is really, you know, just pretty pink, uh, hot pink kind of stain on my lips. Um, I got this one is in uh, Lovesick. Now, as everyone says, it smells, you know, it has like a, a minty eucalyptus kind of smell, which I like because um, it reminds me of like my Carmex, you know, it makes me feel like my lips are being coated in this, you know, healthy schmear. <laughs> and, um, it's, you know, like they say, it's a roll-up. Are you going to roll up from? Yeah, there we go. Okay, it is a roll-up. And it actually, came, it, it, it went on very smoothly. It's very buildable. And for me, because like I said, I have pigmented lips, I had to build it in order to make the color uh, pop. So, um, I heard these things crack when you push the uh, things on too tight. So, um, this here... That color on the bottom there is the Lovesick from the Just Bitten, uh, Revlon Just Bitten Kissable uh, Balm Stain. Um, that is the color there. It's it's a pink with a lot of red as you, as you compare it to the, uh, the NYX Gloss, which has more of a blue tint to it. This is more of a red pink tint. And all obviously, like I said, when you put it on and then you wipe it off, it leaves this rosy pink stain tint on your lips. Which, you know, it's okay. It doesn't bother me. Um, it was, how much was this? This was actually buy one, get one, 50% off, but your girl's a baller on a budget. Okay, so I just purchased the one. I didn't. Because there were a couple of other things that I saw that I, you know, wanted to get. So, you know, I need things. So I got some other stuff as well that I'm not going to talk about right now because it's not your business. <laughs> so I just got that one. Um, now, I did move on over to some of the lower and cheaper uh, things. So I went to the uh, NYC section. And this is the uh, NYC Ultra Moist Lip Wear. This lipstick was only 99 cents, believe it or not. Um, it's a cute color. It's, what's the damn color? 316 Blossom is the color of the uh, lipstick here. I got my little notes. I like to keep notes. I'm a note writer. Here's your color. It's like a bluish pink. And it has um, a little bit of a, like a shimmer to it. I hate it. <laughs> I'm glad I only paid 99 cents for it because it looks absolutely awful on my lips uh, maybe for someone who doesn't have pigmented lips I guess maybe you could kind of call it like a frost it has this this awful pearlescent finish that um, doesn't bode well for someone with pigmented lips such as myself <laughs> it just didn't look just didn't go right for me might go right for you, but it just didn't didn't go good for me. But the other thing that I had gotten from NYC, which actually I I think I'm I'm liking, is the Liquid Lip Shine NYC Liquid Lip Shine. Um, it was two ninety nine. 
I got this. The color is called Fashion Avenue Fuchsia. Now, I, I, I think I kind of fell in love with this. Um, it's got a really cool kind of applicator. It's a doe foot, but it feels like it's got like a little plastic uh, flat piece in there. You know how the doe foot is just an entire doe foot? I think this is the doe foot wrapped around a little plastic flat piece because I can feel it. Now this I'm actually going to put on because I love this color. I actually completely fell in love with this color. Oh, and not to mention the fact that it smells amazing. It smells so good. It smells like um, coconut. It actually smells like my coconut bonbon. Um, it smells like my coconut bonbon lotion from Dylan's Candy Bar. Oh, dear. this is what it looks like on my lips. I love it. Actually, it is really, really, really cute. It's a really cute color. I'm going to swatch it here on my hand as well for you. Awesome, awesome color. And I just can't keep smelling my top lip. <laughs> so, this is a Fashion Avenue Fuchsia at the bottom here. Yep, Fashion Avenue Fuchsia is the name. Um, and it smells like coconuts. And it was only $2.99. Can't go wrong with $2.99. I think I might uh, pick up a couple of other little colors since they're only that, uh, that, that inexpensive. So, um, I don't know, maybe, maybe I can rock the Fashion Avenue Fuchsia with the um, NYX uh, Soft Matte Lip Cream. Mm, we'll see. Maybe I'll do a tutorial. Um, so, yeah, so those are my swatches from my little haul. That was the Soft Matte Lip Cream from NYX and Addis Ababa. That is the sheer gloss from NYX and Caramel. This is the uh, kissable uh, Revlon Just Bitten Kissable Balm Stain in, um, oh gosh, what is the darn color? Love Sick. <laughs> this is the NYC Ultra Moist Lip Wear in Blossom, which I hated. <laughs> and last but not least, this is the NYC Liquid Lip Shine in Fashion Avenue Fuchsia, which I absolutely loved. It was my favorite, my favorite purchase out of all of those pinks that I got. Um, shiny, um, not sticky at all. Perfect pink, at least for me, for what I was looking for. Um, I still wanna try to get the, the like a dolly pink and see how that goes because I've seen some of my friends with it and you know they're able to make it work obviously with a purple lip liner and I have a good friend that's a makeup artist and she you know um, suggested a couple of uh, lipsticks for me to try in that kind of color there was a oh gosh was it Revlon there was a Revlon they have these new caress uh, lipsticks and I saw one it was called like pink vinyl or something like that and I had it in my hand in my hand ready to go to the front and I looked at the price and it was $10.50 and I said I'm not buying a $10 lipstick not from no drugstore not happening maybe if I have a very good day at work I'll go pick it up other than that hell no so <laughs> all in all guys that is my little mini haul um I hope you liked it and um you can rate, you can subscribe, you can check out my blog once again. It's Pink Beauty 78 at, I'm sorry, I can never get this damn address right. Pink Beauty 78.blogspot.com. Check me out. I have some of the funniest things to say. I know I need to review that basketball, not basketball wives, Love and Hip Hop uh, Atlanta Reunion Part 1. That was a train wreck gotta review it so I might review that and um we'll holler guys love you pink out